We're gonna be trying something brand new today. We're gonna to be making a holster for the inside of one of these micro uh, chest rigs. What I'm gonna do is we're going to take one of these thin, cheap uh, IKEA cutting boards, measure out what size pouch we need, and I cut it out and basically we're gonna thermo form uh, this cutting board to this pistol similarly, similarly to how you would uh, do Kydex but I don't have any Kydex that's as thin as I want it that I'd be able to sew through, so we're just gonna give this a try. Um, if you have some super thin Kydex that you could uh, punch some holes through and uh, sew it together, probably use that instead, but we're gonna give this a try. Um, to measure what you need, put your pistol upright like that and roll it from side to side. We wanna leave about an inch left over, so that's good right there. Roll it this way, inch left over, so this right over here is good. So mark that, then come down to keeping the edge right above the trigger guard right there. Then come down to the muzzle and you can make it wherever you want in there. It doesn't matter if the muzzle sticks out a little bit. So that right there is the piece we're gonna wanna cut out. Alrighty. Now basically we're just going to round off all the corners. This thing has like a rough and a smooth side to it. I'm probably gonna put the smooth side against the pistol. So wrap that thing around as if it were in the holster. Give it a look, see if everything looks good. I think that'll work. So going to take some material. Gonna lay this down over top of it. I'm gonna mark out around the outer edge. So I have that traced and just cut out my piece of material. With that cut the shape, I'm gonna grab some three inch hook side Velcro or if your chest rig has hooks out on the inside, then just you know obviously grab opposite of whatever's in there. So it will stick. to use some double sided tape and stick this down to the outside of our piece of material which is kind of right down the middle and we're going to sew this on and do like a stitch down each edge and through the middle. Now take some double sided tape, stick to the back of that. to stick this down on top of it with the uh, rough side sticking to it because like I said this is going to be on the inside like that. All right now that's stuck on there pretty well go ahead and give it a little bit of a bend so uh, it can pull the length that it wants to be around the outside. Now we're going to cut it the exact width so it matches right up because we don't want any hangover. If you have any rough spots in your plastic, now would be the time to clean those up too. Now we're just going to take some of this one inch ribbon, like cross grain, cross the game, something like that, and uh, we're just going to hold that on the outside and we're going to run a stitch all the way around and that ribbon is going to cover up our edges. We're just going to fold in half and uh, stitch right along there. And just kind of slide the pistol into it. See about where you need to stop. I'm going to stitch from here all the way down around to right about there, then come back up for a double stitch. So from right there, down to right there. That way the muzzle can peek out a little bit if it wants to.
There we go. I'm just gonna try to squeeze a little bit from the outside, just like you would mold in a normal Kydex holster. I doubt we're gonna get any like great shape from this, but maybe it'll be easier to slide in and out or in and keep it from sliding out quite as easily. Just giving it a little bit of shape is all we're after. There we go. That looks pretty good.